Hi guys, this is Small Couponer. These are the Walgreens best deals for the week of May 1st through May 7th, 2022. And these are all digital and printable coupon deals. So let's get started. Please share, like, comment, and subscribe. It will really help me out and it's free to subscribe and turn on the notification bell. So make sure that you choose all so that you receive all of the notifications from my channel. So if you have this just for you coupon, this ends on April 30th because of the BOGO 50% off sale. So you can buy two of these for $8.23. They are $5.49, but they are BOGO 50% off. You will use the 5 off 2 digital. So this was like for only for select accounts. You'll pay $3.23. You can pay with Walgreens cash. There is a $2 I bought a rebate for the clean and clear. And my referral code is VPCFRDP. It is also in the description box below if you're interested. So if you are new to Ibotta, you will get a $10 bonus after your first redemption. So this rebate is a limit of three. So you will get $4 back for buying two and the final cost is free and a 76 cent money maker. So the poise, these are two for 11. So buy two of these for $11. Use the two off to digital, pay $9. You can pay this with Walgreens cash. There is a $3 I bought a rebate. It is a limit of two. So get $6 back for two. And the final cost will be $3 for two or $1.50 each. And the perfumes, so select perfumes, they have this promo code, which is um, Arden10, so it only works on certain ones. If you want to get this particular one, these are $23.79. Use this $5 off digital that is attaching to the Viva La Juicy by Juicy Couture. And then you will use um, the $10 off store promo, which is a promo code. So make sure that you do curbside pickup, uh, which is Arden10. So you'll pay $8.79. You can pay this with Walgreens Cash. I just want to note this video was made on April 28, 2022. It is before the new week, but it is a preview of the new week based on the weekly ad, the coupons, and the rebates that we already have. So please check the tax in store, walgreens.com and coupons.com just to make sure that these items are included in the promotion and for new coupons and new promotions. I have already given away both of my Dunkin' and Starbucks cards, so I have to wait until next month to redeem more. In the meantime, I do have a $3 Krispy Kreme gift card, so comment Krispy Kreme if you are interested, and I will reply to a random comment and announce the chosen YouTube username in all of my videos on Sunday. So make sure to check out all of my videos on Sundays, and I will basically reply to your message once you message me, either through Instagram or through email, and I will reply with a gift card. So that is that. Here is the weekly question. Are you couponing more, less, or the same? I know that price are increasing and we are living in a hard time. For me, I am couponing the same. Uh, it depends. It really depends on the deals. So I really pick and choose the deals that I want to do. What about you? So I did get a digital spin booster. I got spin 22, six, get $6 Walgreens cash. It is valid from May 1st through May 7th. So I want to note for any spin deals or any spin boosters, make sure that you do them in store because it is counting this 22 after all um, store coupons and manufacturer coupons online. So in store, it counts it after store coupons, but before manufacturer coupons. So it's a better deal to do it in store. So for this one, you have to do it in store. It has to be 22 after all store coupons. So the forms of store coupons are IVCs, threshold boosters, and register words that have store coupon on the top. So I will explain what IVCs are in the first deal with an IVC coupon. And I do have scenarios that the whole video using this booster. For intermediate or advanced couponers, I do have an ultimate scenario where you can use a lot of Walgreens cash to pay on a spin deal. It's a low out of pocket and you're getting a ton of stuff. So stay tuned. So I did make an update because of the register rewards. So couponing online is different from couponing in store. So coupons apply differently online. So if you have a threshold booster or a spin booster, they apply after IVCs and manufacturer coupons online. In store, it applies after IVCs, but before manufacturer coupons. You can only use a digital spin booster if you are couponing online. In store, you can use either or both digital and or paper spin booster. Boosters. There are no more registry words if you do curbside pickup. It started on the 15th. Your mileage may vary. 
any ad it says register rewards deals are in store only and there is a ten dollar minimum for curbside pickup it is before manufacturer coupons but after ivc's so just a reminder, every Sunday, make sure that you clip your manufacturer digital coupons, check coupons.com app and coupons.com for new manufacturer coupons. Even if you are not couponing on Sunday, I recommend that you at least save the coupons because some coupons, they do have a limit. So they will appear on Sunday and disappear the next day. And more videos will be uploaded based on the new manufacturer coupons and rebates that we get. And make sure that you are subscribed and turn on all notifications so that you receive all of the notifications from this channel. Weekly ads differ from region to region. Most deals are similar, but a few deals may differ. And store pricing may vary from store to store. I will not be going over spend deals because I do have a video link in the description box below explaining each of these bullet points with examples. So if you are a beginner, I highly recommend that you watch that video, just the beginning portion of it. The only thing that Walgreens change is the point system into Walgreens cash. Everything else is still the same as long as you do these deals or spend deals in store because they did change it online. So do the spin deals in store so that you can use the equation in all of these rules. And buy deals will also be explained at the beginning of the video, link in the description box below. Or you can just screenshot this for your reference. So let's get started with all of the deals. Household deals. So the Palm Olive or Fabuloso, these are going to be $2.49. We have a $1 off digital that we are getting on the first. You'll pay $1.49 and you can pay this with Walgreens cash. So there are, you know, increments of redemption for Walgreens cash at Walgreens. So if you were to do this alone, for example, in one transaction, the highest that you could redeem is a dollar and then you'll have to pay the 49 cents plus tax out of pocket. Unless the taxes bump bump it up and your total is like $2, then you could redeem $2 in Walgreens cash because where I am, the Walgreens cash, it covers the taxes. So for the next deal, I want to include this PNG rebate. So the way to submit the rebate is through this website, which is www.pggoodeveryday.com slash rebate slash. And it's a limit of one per household per address. And, you know, you have to have a PG Good Everyday account to do this. So you have to spend 50 or 20 um, after all coupons and discounts and they say store money is a form of discount when I contacted them so it has to be out of pocket and it has to be before taxes so 50 or 20 after all coupons and discounts but before taxes and then you'll get 15 or five dollars in a form of a prepaid visa card that will be mailed to you so it's a physical prepaid visa card and it's only valid for these particular PNG brands, not the ones, not all of them, only the ones listed. And this is valid on purchases between March 27th through June 30th, 2022. And you can do them in separate transactions. So, you know, if you do couponing haul and you pay out of pocket for some of them, you know, they do track the multiple receipts. So that is that. So if you want to do this rebate deal, um, you can do for this one. So these are two for 11 and when you buy four, you get a $6 register reward. So you could get one Tide Paws for $5.50, one Tide Liquid for $5.50, one Charmin for $5.50, and one Bounty for $5.50. So your total comes to $22. So you will use the Spin 22, get $6 Walgreens Cash Digital Booster, $1 off Charmin, and $1 off Bounty. You'll pay $20, but you must pay all of this out of pocket because for any spin deals, you want to follow this equation in red. Especially if it's a spin deal and you're getting Walgreens Cash back. So you have $2 in manufacturer coupons, assuming that you are not using any manufacturer register rewards because um, we all have different ones and you pay the $20. So you have to count the um, uh, out-of-pocket costs before taxes in this equation and it'll be exactly $22 and you have to spend $22 in order to get the $6 back from this booster. So, you know, using this equation in red, the forms of payment that you can use on a spend deal that you're getting Walgreens cash back is manufacturer coupons, manufacturer register rewards because they are manufacturer coupons 
and the um, money out of pocket should be you know counted before taxes equals your spend total so that's why um you have to pay the twenty dollars plus tax all out of pocket you'll get back a six dollar register reward from the deal for buying four and six dollar walgreens cash from the booster for spending 22 using this equation in red and then since you spend 20 dollars out of pocket submit your receipt to the png website to get this five dollar png rebate when you spend 20 out of pocket and the final cost is three dollars for four items or 75 cents each so if you have a paper spin booster go ahead and combine it with this digital one to get extra Walgreens cash back because you're paying out of pocket anyways. So you can combine a paper spin booster with a digital spin booster to get extra Walgreens cash back. You only need to spend the highest threshold of one of them to get all of your Walgreens cash back. Or if you don't want to do that PNG rebate, you can do it this way and use some printable coupons because I'm not sure if we're getting um, digital coupons for the Tide. So make sure that you check. If we get digital versions, you don't have to use the printables. So this is booster scenario number two. So you'll get the same items and your total will be the same. You will use the same booster and then you will use a $1 off Tide Pots printable and $1 off Tide Liquid printable. And both of them are from pggoodeveryday.com. Make sure that you print on the date that you are going to use these coupons because only the coupons from the pggoodeveryday.com website expires within 24 hours. And then you will use the same digitals for the paper products. You'll pay $18, but you have to pay all of this out of pocket based on the equation. You have $4 in manufactured coupons. If you pay the $18 out of pocket, your spend total is 22. So you have to pay the 18 plus tax all out of pocket. You'll get back a $6 registry reward from the deal and $6 Walgreens cash from a booster. Final cost is $6 for four or $1.50 each. That is if you don't want to do that PNG rebate. And again, if you have a paper spin booster, go ahead and combine it with this digital one to get extra Walgreens cash back because you're paying out of pocket anyways. So for these deals, I will wait to see if we get any high value manufactured digitals. If we don't, then skip the deal. And this is a no manufacturer coupon needed is a great filler and great way to use your registry rewards. So the Arm & Hammer laundry detergent or the scent booster, these are buy one at $7.49 and you get two free. So basically you get three for $7.49. That is a good deal. And make sure to check for any digitals because sometimes we get like $1 off Arm & Hammer digitals. So I just want to note, registry rewards sometimes affect manufactured digitals not coming off. You can use registry rewards, the ones that have manufactured coupon on the top, without problems if you are using paper or printable manufactured coupons exclusively in a transaction without any manufactured digitals. But you may need a filler if you have more manufactured coupons than items. And you can also use register rewards on items without any manufactured coupons to lower your out of pocket, like using it on bleach because we don't normally get coupons for bleach and it will lower your out of pocket. You can even use a combination of register rewards and Walgreens cash to pay for your transaction. Like for example, if the bleach costs, you know, $7, you can use uh, a $4 register reward and then, um, you know, $3 Walgreens cash, if that makes sense. So not all register rewards are manufactured coupons. Some of them was a store coupon on the top. Do not use these on spend deals, but you do not need a filler if you were to use it on a buy deal and you already have a manufactured coupon attaching to each item. The ones that have manufactured coupon on the top, you can use these on spend deals because they are manufactured coupons, but you may need a filler if you have more manufactured coupons than items. Food deals. 
So the 12 pack Pepsi or Dr. Pepper products, these are three for $10.99. So if your store carries the Mountain Dew Spark, the 12 pack, you can buy three of those for $10.99 if they are available and included in this promotion. You can pay this with Walgreens cash or a register reward or the combination of both. There is a $2 I bought a rebate for this product. It is a limit of five. And again, my referral code is VPCFRDP. It is also in the description box below if you're interested. And if you are new to Ibotta, you will get a $10 bonus after your first redemption. So you will get $6 back for buying three. And there's also a $0.25 cent bonus when you redeem two or more times. So the final cost will be $4.74 for three or $1.58 each. So the um, soft drinks, so that includes the 7-Up, Canada Dry, A&W, and, or Sunkiss, the 12 packs. These are three for $11.99. So if your store carries the simple 7-Up, the 12 pack, you'll buy three of those for $11.99 if they are included in this promotion. You can pay this with Walgreens cash or a register reward. There is a $1.50 I bought a rebate for this. It is a limit of five. So get $4.50 back for three. And a final cost is $7.49 for three or $2.50 each. So if you want to include the sodas in a booster scenario, you can buy three of the Mountain Dew, uh, Mountain Dew Spark, the 12 ounces for $10.99, three of the Simple 7 Up for $11.99, and your total comes to $22.98. You will use the Spin 22, get $6 Walgreens cash, and you'll pay $22.98. Make sure that you pay all of this out of pocket because based on the equation, you have no coupons, so you pay the $22.98 out of pocket and your spin total is $22.98. You'll get back a $6 Walgreens cash from the booster and then you'll submit your receipt to Ibotta to get a total of $6.25 back for the Mountain Dew Spark, the 12 pack, and $4.50 back for the Simple 7 Up, the 12 pack. Final cost is $6.23 for six or $1.04 for each. So if your stores don't carry these, then skip the deal. So um, if you want to do the ice cream deals, do not include it in a spin booster deal because it does exclude dairy. But for some reason, I can redeem Walgreens cash with the ice cream. So these are two for $9. So I see that Talanti is in the picture. So if you can find a Gelato layers, those are, you know, two for $9. If they are included in this promotion, you can pay this with Walgreens cash or a register reward. There is a $1.25 I bought a rebate. It is a limit of three. So you get $2.50 back for two. And then there's also a 50 cent bonus when you redeem two or more times. And the final cost is $6 for two or $3 each. Or you could get the regular Talanti for $9. You can pay this with Walgreens cash or a register reward. There is a $1 I bought a rebate for it. It is a limit of three. So you get $2 back for two. And then the 50 cent bonus when you redeem two or more times. And the final cost is $6.50 for two or $3.25 each. Or you could get the Brayers for $9. So you can pay this with Walgreens cash or a register reward. There is a 75 cent I bought a rebate. It is a limit of three. So you get 150 back for two. And a 50 cent bonus when you redeem two or more times. And a final cost is $7 for two or $3.50 each. So I want to know there are also I bought a rebates for the Magnum and Ben and Jerry if they are part of this promotion. So the Nabisco Oreos or not Oreos, Nabisco cookies or crackers. These are two for $6. So if you can find the new flavors of the Oreos that are included in the Ibotta rebates, you can buy two of these for $6. You can pay this with Walgreens cash or a register reward. There is a $1 Ibotta rebate for some of the newer flavors. It is a limit of five, so get $2 back for two. And a final cost is $4 for two or $2 each. So if your stores don't carry those flavors, then skip the deal. The red vine, so this I bought a rebate is expiring, so make sure that you check to see if it's still there before purchasing. These are three for four dollars. You can pay this with Walgreens cash or a register reward. There is a 75 cent I bought a rebate. It is a limit of five, so you get 225 back for three. And a final cost is 175 for three or 58 cents each. So if if it's not three for four in store, then do curbside. So the Aunt Jemima, these are the 8 ounce syrup. They are a dollar. You'll buy two of these for two dollars. Use the one off two digital, pay a dollar for two or 50 cents each. And you can pay this with Walgreens cash. 
So these are some known manufacturer coupons needed. They are great fillers and great way to use your register rewards. So, you know, if the Mountain Dew Spark, if you cannot find those, the Pepsi 3 for $10.99 is still a great deal because some stores, they are even more expensive, like 2 for $10.99 or 2 for 11 So, you know, this is a good price if you are if you need soda. And the old El Peso, these are bogo free. The single serve candies, two for one seventy four. The um nice select nuts, these are bogo free. I think the cheapest was like three ninety nine, so you could get two of them for three ninety nine. And the DiGiorno Pizza, they did increase the price for this, so these are two for eleven. Beauty slash personal care deals. So this is the deal of the week, and they are usually part of the same deal so make sure that you know if you want to do this deal make sure that you do it in se all of these deals in separate transactions because if you do multiples in one transaction you're only going to get one four dollar register reward so do it in separate transactions so that you get a four dollar register rewards back each time and make sure that you use a register rewards from a different deal so that you get another register rewards back and i do have this explained at the beginning of the video link in the description box below if you are a beginner i highly recommend that you watch that beginning portion of that video so this is the first scenario if you want to do the crest or earl b these are four dollars so all of these are buy two get four dollar register reward so you'll buy two of these for eight dollars use the three off two digital you'll pay five dollars you can pay this with walgreens cash get back a four dollar register reward and there is a 25 cent i bought a rebate for the crest pro health so make sure that one of the item is a crest pro health and a final cost will be 75 cents for two or 37 cents each so i know we had like i bought a rebates for the earl b last week so make sure that you check your ibotta account just to make sure if we get anything for earl b then it could be a better deal scenario two the tresemme these are two for ten so you will use the four off two digital pay six dollars you can pay this walgreens cash get back a four dollar register reward and the final cost is two dollars for two or one dollar each Scenario 3. The Olay or Old Spice Bath Care, these are two for 13. So what you would do is buy three of these for 1950. So at Walgreens, when you buy in multiples, they will brace, base the pricing based on the $13, two, two for $13. Um, if you only buy one, then it'll be seven forty nine. So if you buy in multiples, they will base the price on that two for thirteen. So that's why three of these in nineteen fifty. So it is different from other stores where the extra one is you know cost more. But at Walgreens, it's not the case. You will use the five out three digital, pay fourteen fifty. You can pay this with Walgreens cash, get back a four dollar register reward, and a final cost is ten fifty for three or three fifty each. Scenario four. So I want to include this in a booster scenario. You could get two of the Huggies for $21 and two candy as a filler for $174. Total comes to $22.74. Use the spin 22, get $6 Walgreens cash digital booster and the five off two digital that I assume we will be getting for the Huggies. You'll pay $17.74 and make sure that you pay all of it out of pocket because if you follow the equation in red, you have $5 in manufacturer coupons. If you pay the $17.74 out of pocket, your spend total is $22.74. So you have to pay the $17.74 plus tax out of pocket. Get back a $4 register reward from the deal and $6 Walgreens cash from the booster. So your final cost is $7.74 for two or $3.87 each. So I'm not counting the fillers. So the Tons of Maine toothpaste or deodorant, these are buy two, get $3 Walgreens cash. So if the Tom's of Maine Kids toothpaste are included in this deal, you'll buy two of those for $4.79. Use the $2 off digital because it includes the Tom's of Maine and the $1 off Tom's of Maine digital. So you'll pay $6.58. You can pay this with Walgreens cash, get back $3 Walgreens cash, and the final cost is $3.58 for two or $1.79 each. So if you have already used or if the Tom's of Maine Digital disappeared, 
um, this is what you can do. So you'll buy two of the same items, use the $2 off digital, pay $7.58, you can pay this with Walgreens cash, get back $3 Walgreens cash, and then you'll submit your receipt to the coupons.com app to get $2 back for the other toothpaste that you did not have manufactured coupons for. Because on this app, these are basically digital versions of manufactured coupons. So if you don't have inserts or printable coupons, you can submit to this app to get money back for items that you do not have manufactured coupons for. So the final cost is two fifty eight for two or one twenty nine each. So this is the Colgate toothpaste. So these are buy two get four dollar Walgreens cash, and they are also three ninety nine. You'll buy two of these for seven ninety eight. Use the four off to digital, pay three ninety eight. You can pay this with Walgreens cash, get back four dollar Walgreens cash, and the final cost will be free. So if you still have that two dollar off digital on your account, I recommend that you get rid of that first, and then do you know this four off two deal. Because if you have both of them clipped, um, you know, that $2 off may come off instead of the 4 off 2. So, um, you know, just make sure. So this is a booster scenario number 5. You could get 2 Tresemme for $10, 2 Colgate for $7.98, 1 Palm Olive for $2.49, and 2 Aunt Jemima Syrup for $2. Total comes to $22.47. Use the Spin 22, get $6 Walgreens cash, 4 off 2 Tresemme, 4 off 2 Colgate, $1 off Palm Olive, and 1 off 2 Pearl Milling. You'll pay $12.47 plus tax all out of pocket. Um, you know, based on the equation, you have to pay all of it out of pocket in order to to meet your spin threshold of 22. So you'll get back $4 registry work from the Colgate, I mean, not the Colgate, the Tresemme, $4 Walgreens cash from the Colgate, and $6 Walgreens cash from the Booster. Final cost is free and a dollar and 53 cent money maker. So the big disposables, these are buy two, get $5 registry reward. So you'll buy two of the Big Soleil or Big Flex, depending on, you know, your choice and make sure that you know they are included in the rebates so two of these will be $13.58 use that four dollar off digital pay $9.58 you can pay this with Walgreens cash get back five dollar register reward and there is a three dollar I bought a rebate when you buy two and there's also a six dollar check out 51 rebate when you buy two final cost is free and a four dollar and 42 cent money maker so the Shea Moisture Bath Care, if you don't want to do this, you know, um, spin deal, you can just, you know, get two items. So if you get the bar soap, these are cheaper online. They are $4.19. In store, they are $5.99. Well, at least where I am. So if you could get online price match or if you could if you could do curbside, you'll buy two of these for eight thirty eight. We are getting a five off two digital. Make sure that we, we you check for more digitals because sometimes we get like multiples, even though it's not advertised in the ad. Because if we get multiples, we can do the spin deal. You'll pay three thirty eight for two or one sixty nine each and you can pay this with Walgreens cash. So this is for the Shea Moisture Hair Care. They are BOGO 50% off. So again, if you don't want to do the spin deal, um, you can buy two of these Curl Enhancing Smoothie if they are included in the promo. And these two of these will be $5.08 because they are BOGO 50% off. Use the 5 off 2 digital if it attaches to this particular product. Pay $0.08 cents for 2 or $0.04 cents each. If the digital isn't attaching to it, then skip the deal. And if we get more digitals, then maybe we can do this spin deal. I'm not sure if we're getting a 5 of 2 for the bath care and a 5 of 2 for the hair care or if it's going to, going to be like lumped together. So make sure that you check. So if it's part of the same deal, because both of these are spend 25, get $10 Walgreens cash. So I'm not sure if they are part of the same deal or not. And if we're getting two different manufactured digitals, if they are part of the same deal, and if we are getting two different manufactured digitals, then this is what you would do. You'll buy two of the Shea Moisture hair product. If you get the ones that are $869, um, second one will be 50% off. So it'll be $1303. And then two of the Shea Moisture bar soaps for $1198. If they are $5.99 each. So total comes to $25.01. Use the spin 22, get $6 Walgreens cash, and two of the five off two digitals if they are attaching to you know these items. And if we get you know both of these digitals, you'll pay $15.01. Make sure that you pay all of it out of pocket because you know, follow the equation in red, you have to spend $25 based on this deal.
so that you get everything back. So you'll get $10 Walgreens cash from the deal for spending $25 and $6 Walgreens cash from the booster. Final cost will be free and a 99 cent money maker. So if we if they are not part of the same deal and if we don't get two of these five off two digitals, then skip the deal unless you have insert coupons. So the Axe Dove Caress St. Ives or Swap, these are BOGO 50% off. When you spend 20, you get $5 Walgreens cash. So make sure to check to see if all of these are included. So you'll buy two of the Dove Body Wash. These are $9.79. So second one will be 50% off. So you know two of them will be $14.68. And then you'll get one of the Dove Body Love Body Wash for $9.99 if they are included in this deal. So your total will be $24.67. Use the spin 22, get $6 Walgreens cash, 7 off to Dove, and $3 off Dove Body Love. So you'll pay $14.67, but you can pay $2 of it with Walgreens cash and pay the $12.67 plus tax out of pocket. Because if you follow the equation in red, you have $10 in manufacturer coupons. If you only pay the $12.67 out of pocket, your spin total is $22.67. So you can only pay with $2. Walgreens cash. So you'll get back $5 Walgreens cash from the deal and $6 Walgreens cash from the booster. Final cost is $3.67 for three or $1.22 each. So I just want to note, you can only use Walgreens Cash as a partial payment if you are using a digital spin booster only. That is, if you are not using contactless payment. You cannot use Walgreens Cash to pay at all if you also use a paper spin booster or if you are combining it with a digital spin booster. So that is if you are not using contactless payment. If you are using contactless payment and if you don't have a digital spin booster, you can pay with Walgreens cash if you use a paper spin booster, but you have to use contactless payment. And these are the forms of contactless payment that is shown in the picture. And make sure that you scan the card barcode from the app rather than putting your phone number. Or you can do it this way and get two Dove Body Wash for $14.68 and two Caress for $8.68. So at Walgreens, it usually takes off 50% off the same item rather than the lower price item. So that's why it will take off this way instead of, you know, the Caress, both of the Caress being 50% off, if that makes sense. So total comes to $23.36. Use the spin 22, get $6 Walgreens cash and the seven off to Dove. You'll pay $16.36. You can pay $1 of it with Walgreens cash and a $15.36 plus tax out of pocket. Get back $5 Walgreens cash from the deal, $6 Walgreens cash from a the booster. There is a $1.25 five cent a uh, caress check out 51 rebate it is a limit of five so get 250 back for two and the final cost is 286 for four or 72 cents each so this particular deal i'm not sure if the avino um, bath care is included so make sure to check to see if all of these are included because it's a skincare Avino Neutrogena clean and clear and or Lubriderm and Lubriderm is a body care product so I'm assuming the body wash may be included so make sure that you check you'll buy one of the Avino body wash for $5.99 one Avino body wash for $6.99 and four clean and clear facial wash if you get the ones that are $6.99 four of them will be $27.96 so your total is $40.94 you will use the spin 22 get six dollar walgreens cash two of the two dollar off of you know body wash digitals so i have two different ones they have two different expiration dates and two of the five of two neutrogena are clean and clear and these digitals were like just for you digitals so it was only for select accounts and i have two different ones and they also have two different expiration dates so you'll pay 26.94 and you have to pay all of it out of pocket based on the equation in red you have to spend 40 dollars in order to get everything back so you'll get a uh, You'll get back a $15 Walgreens cash for spending $40 from the deal, $6 Walgreens cash from the booster, and then you'll submit your receipt to Ibotta to get, um, it's a $2 Ibotta rebate for the Avino body wash, but it is a limit of three, so get $4 back for two, and $2 for the clean and clear, it is a limit of three, so you get $6 back because the limit is three, so you could, the max they can get back is $6, even though you have four items. The final cost will be free in a $4.06 money maker. Or you could get one Neutrogena gentle, gentle Cleanser for 549 
one Neutrogena Fresh Cleanser for $6.79, and four Clean and Clear Facial Wash for $27.96. Total comes to $40.24. Use the Spin 22, get $6 Walgreens cash. The 5 of 2 Neutrogena Facial Cleansing. So I think this is also a just for you coupon for select accounts. And two of the 5 of 2 Neutrogena or Clean and Clear. It'll pay $25.24 plus tax all out of pocket because based on equation, you have to spend $40, get back $15 Walgreens cash from the deal, sixteen uh, $6 Walgreens cash from the booster, and then on Ibotta, you get you know $6 back for the clean and clear. Final cost is free and a $1.76 moneymaker. So the L'Oreal LV, these are $3.99, we have a $1 off digital, and we are you know, we have a $1 off IVC. So IVCs are Walgreens store coupons in the monthly savings booklet. They are located at the front of the store near the weekly ads. So those rectangular booklets are the ones that you will grab and go to the index, find the brand name, and have the cashier scan a barcode. Or you could just clip it from the app. Anything that has my Walgreens behind a coupon is an IVC. Without it, then it's a manufacturer coupon. So IVCs are basically store coupons. So you'll pay $1.99. You can pay this with Walgreens cash. So the Kate Hair Care, it says it's bogo free. So if the cheapest item is included, um, you'll buy, you know, two of these masks for $2.99 because they are bogo free. So it'll be $2.99 for two or $1.49 each. And you can pay this with Walgreens cash or a registered reward. So the Jurgens, um, these are BOGO 50% off, and when you buy two, you get $2 Walgreens cash. So if the cheapest Jurgens is included, these are $5.29, second one will be 50% off, so two of them will be $7.93 if they are included. You will use the $1.50 off digital and $1.50 off, off printable from coupons.com, or you can submit to the coupons.com app if you don't have the printable. You'll pay $4.93, you can pay this with Walgreens cash, get back $2 Walgreens cash, and your final cost is $2.93 for two or $1.47 each. So if you want to include this in a scenario, you could get two Jergens for $7.93 if they are included in that promotion, two of the Crest or Earl B for $8, make sure that one of them is a Crest Pro Health, unless we get new Ibotta rebates for the Oral B, and two of the Colgate for $7.98. Total comes to $23.91, Use the spin 22, get $6 Walgreens cash, um, $1.50 off Jergens, $1.50 off Jergens printable from coupons.com, 3 off 2 Crestor Earl B, and 4 off 2 Colgate. You'll pay $13.91. You can pay $1 of it with Walgreens cash and a $12.91 out of pocket. You'll get back a $2 Walgreens cash from the Jergens, $4 registry worth from the Crestor Earl B, $4 Walgreens cash from the Colgate, and $6 Walgreens cash from the Booster. And then you'll submit your receipt to Ibotta to get 25 cents back for the Crest Pro Health. Final cost is free in a $2.34 money maker. So I would recommend that you do curbside for this because um, it does not adjust down if you do it in store for manufactured coupons. It only adjusts down for IVCs in store. So um, online, the manufacturer coupons, they do adjust down. So these are BOGO 50% off. So you buy two of these for $3.73, use that four off two. So it will adjust down to $3.73 online and it will be free. You just have to pay any sale tax if you have any. So for this one, um, make sure that the four off two is already gone from your account and you only have these two clipped to your account in order for this to work out. So you can buy one of the loose powder for $4.99 and one eyeliner for $2.24. Total is $7.23. You will use that $4 off digital and $3 off digital and that will adjust down to $2.24 if you do curbside. You'll pay $0.99 cents for two or $0.49 cents each. So if the taxes bump it up to like a dollar and some change, you can actually redeem, you know, $1 in Walgreens cash because uh, Walgreens cash redemption starts at $1. If your state does not have sales tax, then maybe add something really cheap in order to redeem uh, Walgreens cash because it starts at $1. And if this for some reason isn't working out online, skip the deal. So the Ame, these are buy two, get $4 register reward. So if the seven off two is attaching to the makeup removers, you'll buy two of those for $11.98. They are $5.99 each. We are getting a seven off two digital. Pay $4.98. You can pay this with Walgreens cash. Get back a $4 register reward. And the final cost is $0.98 cents for two or $0.49 cents each. 
So for these deals, I think they will be great deals if we get some manufactured digitals, printables, or even, you know, digital versions of it from the coupons.com app on the first, especially for the userin because we have I bought a rebates for that. Baby deals. So um, the Pampers or Ninjamas, these are two for 20. When you buy two, you get a $5 register reward. So you could you could get two Ninjamas for $20 and two Aunt Jemima for $2. Total comes to $22. You will use the spend 22, get $6 Walgreens cash digital booster. I'm assuming we may get like a four off two Ninjamas. So um, make sure that you check. This is based on, you know, pat the past month and a one-off two pearl milling. You'll pay $17. You must pay all of it out of pocket pocket because based on the equation you must spend 22 you'll get back five dollar register worth from the deal six dollar walgreens cash from the booster final cost is six dollars for four or 150 each or you could get two pampers for twenty dollars and two on jemima for two dollars total comes to twenty two dollars you to spend 22 get six dollar walgreens cash a three off two pampers and one off two pearl milling you'll pay eighteen dollars plus tax all out of pocket based on the equation you must you know spend at least twenty two get back five dollar register worth from the deal six dollar walgreens cash from a booster final cost is seven dollars for four or 175 each so if you want to do a big PNG scenario, this is what you can do. You could get two Pampers for $20, one Bounty for $5.50, two Charmin for $11, one, one Tide for $5.50, and three Old Spice Bath Care for $19.50. Total comes to $61.50. Use the Spin 22, get $6 Walgreens Cash Digital Booster, three off two Pampers, one dollar off Bounty, one dollar off Charmin, one dollar off Tide Printable, and five off three Old Spice, Old Late, and etc. Digital. So your total manufacturer coupons is $11. You'll pay $50.50 plus tax and all of it out of pocket. So you want to meet both thresholds. The PNG rebate, which is $50 out of pocket, and the spin booster. So for the spin booster, you follow the equation in red. You have $11 in manufacturer coupons, and if you pay the $50.50 out of pocket, your spin total is well over $22. It's $61.50. So you'll get back $5 register reward from the um, Pampers, $6 register reward from the Bounty Charmin Tide, $4 register reward from the Old Spice Bath Care, $6 Walgreens Cash from the Booster, and then you'll submit your receipt to that PNG website to get $15 back when you spend $50 out of pocket. Final cost is $14.50 for 9 items or $161 each. So if you happen to have a spin 50, get $10 Walgreens cash digital booster. Um, everything else is the same. It's just that the booster is different and you're going to get a $10 Walgreens cash back instead of a $6 Walgreens cash back. And then after everything is said and done, your final cost will be $10.50 for nine items or $117 each. So, you know, this is a good deal. Health deals. So the Asper Cream, this is the Flex Motion. So these are BOGO 50% off. When you buy two, you get a $5 register reward. So I did check in store. They did carry this. So these are $18.99 where I am. So two of these will be $28.48 because they are BOGO 50% off. Use the Spin 22, get $6 Walgreens cash, a $5 off digital. Um, I'm assuming we may get another $5 off digital based on the ad. So you'll pay $18.48. You can pay $5 of it with Walgreens cash and then $13.48 plus tax out of pocket. Because if you follow the equation in red, if we get another $5 off digital, then your manufacturer coupons will be $10. And if you pay the $13.48 out of pocket, your spend total is $23.48. So um, you can only pay with $5 Walgreens cash. You cannot pay more with Walgreens cash because the next level of redemption is $10 Walgreens cash. So if you pay with $10 Walgreens cash, you will lower the spend threshold to less than $22. So you can only pay with $5 Walgreens cash. You'll get back $5 register reward from the deal, $6 Walgreens cash from a the booster. There is a $4 I bought a rebate. It is a limit of three, so get $8 back for two. Final cost is free and a 51 cent money maker. So even if we don't get another $5 off digital, I think it's still a good deal for this product because, you know, regular price is $18.99. So it's still a great deal. So the Moderma, these are $20.99. We have a $7 off digital and a $5 off IVC. You'll pay $8.99. You can pay this with Walgreens cash. There is a $5 I bought a rebate and the final cost will be $3.99. 
So the Clear Care or Opti Free, these are sixteen ninety nine. We have we got we uh, we're gonna get a six dollar off digital, and we have a four dollar off IVC, and you'll pay six ninety nine. You can pay this with Walgreens cash. So if you want to include the OptiFree in a scenario, you could get two big disposables for $13.58, one OptiFree for $16.99, and your total will be $30.57. So we have the $4 off IVC for the OptiFree, and your new total is $26.57. Use the Spin22, get $6 Walgreens cash, $4 off big disposables, and $6 off OptiFree. You'll pay $16.57, you can pay $4 of it with Walgreens cash, and a $12.57 plus tax out of pocket. Get back $5 register worth from the big disposables, $6 Walgreens cash from the booster, and then you'll submit a receipt to Ibotta to get uh, $3 back for buying two of the big and $6 back for buying two of the big from Checkout 51. Final cost is free in a $3.43 moneymaker. So for the allergy relief, these are buy two, get $5 register reward. So if the cheaper items are included in this particular deal, um, you'll buy two of these for $5.98. They are $3.99 each, and they are BOGO 50% off. You can pay this with Walgreens cash or a register reward. Get back $5 Walgreens cash, and the final cost is $0.98 cents for two or $0.49 cents each. So if they are not included, then skip the deal. Same goes with this one. So if the, if the $4.99 ones are included, you'll buy two of these for $7.48. Um, you can pay this with Walgreens Cash or a register reward. Get back $5 register reward, and the final cost is $2.48 for two or $1.24 each. If they are not included, skip the deal. So for these deals, I will wait to see if we get any main factor digitals. I know some of these we are getting them, but um, I want I want to see if we get any rebates, and you know it could be a better deal with rebates. Miscellaneous deals. So the gift card, um, when you buy any two of these, so you could get like the two of the cheapest cards, like the Panera is like fifteen dollars, so you could get two of those for thirty, and then you'll get a ten dollar Walgreens gift card. So I want to know for gift card deals, make sure that you pay out of pocket because Walgreens cash and register rewards, they do exclude things like dairy, tobacco, gift cards, and etc. Ultimate scenario. So you can buy one Opti Free for $16.99, two Colgate for $7.98, two Ame Makeup Remover for $11.98, and one Moderma SPF 30 for $20.99. Total comes to $57.94. Um, so the IVCs are $4 off for the Opti Free and $5 off for the Moderma. New total is $48.94. You will use the Spin 22, get $6 Walgreens cash, $6, $6 off Opti Free, 4 off to Colgate, 7 off to Ame and $7 off Moderma. So your total manufacturer coupons is $24. You'll pay $24.94, but you can pay $20 of it with Walgreens cash and pay the $4.94 plus tax out of pocket. Based on the equation, you have $24 in manufacturer coupons. That alone pay for that spin 22 part from the booster. And if you pay the $4.94 out of pocket, your spin total is $28.94. That's well over $22. So that's why you can pay $20 of it with Walgreens cash. You'll get back a total of $19. $6 Walgreens cash from a booster for spinning 22 using the equation in red. $4 Walgreens cash for buying two of the Colgate. $4 register reward for buying two of the Ame. And $5 I bought a rebate for the Moderma. So your final cost is $5.94 for six items or $0.99 cents each. That is a good deal because the Moderma and the OptiFree, they are like the most expensive products in this scenario. And that is it for me. Thanks for watching. Bye.